Mission Yo, success. what's really good, YouTube? It's your boy Bars of 29 back at it again with another Black Ops 2 video. This time, man, I got a first impression video for one of the new maps of the DLC Uprising Map Pack. This one is Studio The Fire Range Remake. And I'm um, just giving you guys my initial thoughts. This is my first time playing on this map. And I just want to let you guys know how I feel and what I like and what I dislike about this map. Number one, I do like the fact that they brought back a version of Fire Range. It's not... It's, the map layout is just like Fire Range, number one. But it, everything is not the same. It's like a more playful, like, fake type of Fire Range, which I don't like. Like, I don't know why. It's just something about this map... I don't like like the playful fakeness of the map. You know what I'm saying? Like they just put too much in the map. Okay, number one. And um, number two, it's like it's like a, a movie set or some shit. Like that's just dumb. Like I guess that's why it's called studio. But I mean, what's the point of having firing range if it's like a movie set? You get what I'm saying? So I, I'm not feeling that part. But um, one part that I really do like is that they bought Fire Range back. Okay, Fire Range was my favorite map on Black Ops One, and Nuketown probably was after that. You know, so that's my favorite part about the map is that Fire Range is back in a way. And uh, n another thing, look at this. What the fuck is this in here? It's like they just put this together. It's like, what is this? Is, are these supposed to be guns? Are these supposed to be pictures? It just looks so fake and not good put together it just looked like they rushed to put this together it's so stupid i don't like the graphics in there at, at all i'm really upset about that because it's like they just made it a cheap map pack and they just wanted to get out quick and i'm not feeling that at all man and i'm really disappointed in that um and i really wish trey out would have done better with that because that really turned me off and i'm just like wow wow I feel like I wasted my money to get quality like that. You feel what I'm saying? So, I'm really upset at that part, okay? I haven't played any other maps. Oh, no, I did. I played uh, Encore, and I'll be uploading that as soon as possible, guys. Sorry that I haven't uploaded videos in a while either. As you know, I do have this new job that's just eating my hours away, man. I get like 95 hours every two weeks, so it's a lot of time. It's a lot of... It's, it's definitely a lot, you know what I'm saying? So... Bear with me, guys. I appreciate everybody who stuck around with your boy. Those my true niggas right there, man. Hey, y'all my brothers, man. I fuck with y'all. I just added a lot of people who just added me on my friend list. I told y'all I accept all from requests, man. If I have room, I do play with you guys when I have the chance. So trust me, I will add you. If you add me, just send me a message telling me that you from me, the YouTube or whatever, wherever you're from, man. And um, I definitely get back at you. I have no problem with that. I'm not one of them uptight commentator guys. I'm a regular dude that plays Call of Duty, that plays video games. Like, yeah, don't don't believe the hype of commentators. They're not no special people. They're regular people just like you. I'm a regular person just like you. And I'm not even, like, amazing at the game compared to these other people on, on YouTube. Like, I'm a regular guy. You get what I'm saying? So... Like, yeah, I add you guys, no problem. So definitely just add me up, man. And also, I hit 700 subscribers. I'm past 700 subscribers. I think I'm at 713 subscribers. That's a big milestone for me, man. Like, I remember when I, I couldn't even hit 100 subscribers. It took me damn near a year to hit 100 subscribers, man. And, like, I'm at 700 subscribers within, what's that? Uh, four, five, six months, five months, I think. I'm, I, I had 700 subscribers after I hit 100 subscribers in five months. So that's not bad, man. That's really good to me. That's great progress to me, you know what I'm saying? I really appreciate all the love and support you guys get from me. And, um, I just want to say this, like, I watch other YouTubers and, like, you read their comments and stuff. They get a lot of hate. You know what I'm saying? They get a lot of hate. They get a lot of people, like, talking down on them, talking trash to them. And I must say, I don't get that. You know, and I'm really proud that I don't get that because that's telling me I'm doing something right. It's telling me that I'm bringing content that people enjoy. I'm a person that people enjoy. And it's no no shit or bash stuff people want to say to me. You know what I'm saying? I really respect that, guys. 
And you guys are truthful with me. Like, you tell me if you don't like things. You tell me what you want to see. I really appreciate that, man. So, I want to do something very special for you guys. When I hit a 1,000 subscribers, trust me, I'm going to do something big for y'all. I'm going to give away an ultimate giveaway, okay? So, make sure you guys stay tuned for that. And if you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe, man. And don't forget to hit that like button. Rape that like button in the ass. Follow me over on Twitter. The link will be in the description. I will be back soon. It's your boy, Bazza29. Don't forget, only God can judge you, and that's my time.